Here's what they all have in common. They had something in their hand already and God chose to use what was in their hand. The story of Moses, Moses is kind of whining and complaining and complaining and saying, Lord, why me? I think you have the wrong person. And it's like God looks around and says, ah, there's something I can use. Moses, what's in your hand? And Moses says, I have a staff. And God says, perfect. The story of David, what does David have in his hand? A slingshot. And scripture says that he actually tried on the appropriate armor. And he said, no, 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 no. This isn't me. This is somebody else's gifting. But what I actually have is a sling and stone. And I know how to use it. What does Paul have? Education. He's good with words. He's a good writer. He's a great apologist. He knows his theology. You look at your life. You have something to give. It may just be a sling. It may be an education. It may be your upbringing. It may be farm experience. Maybe you're just good with numbers. Sometimes the very thing that we view as our weakness, God looks at you and says, that is exactly the thing that I'm going to use.